Okay guys, a little short video here. I'm um, replacing these chair guides. These are the chair guides that came from the manufacturer. And what happens is they start to wear out and there's a little nail. It's a little nail. You can see it there. And if you see that, you should be able to but what happens that nail starts to scrape the wood floor can't see it there this one's starting to come through here this one's okay right now and then you get these little scratches in your in your floor and you say where is this coming from well this is where it's coming from it's coming from these little nails in these cheap glides they put on the chairs so we're going to change them today and I'm going to show you how to do it. It's a pretty simple process. This is a really quick video. Take a flat head screwdriver or a chisel and just twist. Get under it, put pressure on it and this twist and it comes out. You're looking to be on like a 40 degree angle with your screwdriver and you just pressure these things out and then I'm going to drill new holes and put new glides on so they don't scratch the floors and you can do it the same way on a couch or anything else in your house and these are the new glides I'm going to put on there I was looking for black but unfortunately I couldn't find them uh, but a way to dress these up, if you want to, is just go get a, get a black Sharpie. And just go around the edges with the black Sharpie. And uh, that'll be the end of that. It'll be black. You might have to give it a couple of coats. But that's a little trick if you want to make it black so people don't see them. Yeah, it almost looks like uh, white shoes on, on the bottom of a black leg some people may bother i'm probably gonna get the sharpie and color it black okay so i opened the package up and it's basically a glide with a nail on it as you can see here that nail is about an inch long and we're going to drill pre-drill a hole so we don't crack the leg and that's really what's key here. You don't want to crack the leg and do damage to your furniture. So I have a 564th drill bit that I'm using uh, with these glides that I'm going to pre-drill a hole. Um, and you'll see that uh, this is a one, two, three thing. This is not a big deal. If you have a hole in the center already, uh, that would be uh, pretty simple. I'm going to do this leg first. I'll move this in here so you can get an idea. This one here is pretty centered. And you, when you drill the hole, you don't want to drill too close to the other hole that's there already. Okay? So you want to drill like a little bit over, like an eighth of an, an, eighth of an inch away. Because then what will happen is you go into the other hole and that won't work and you're trying to send, find the center you can use a pencil if you want um, I'm doing this by eye okay and I'm gonna drill all these first before and that one's pretty close and I just guide it with my thumb Find center, back off of it, take a look at it. Looks good to me. Drill down. I'm going to do the same with this one here. And my last one. Last one's pretty close too. All right, gonna get a hammer. And we're gonna base.
thing is in. No glue required. You'll hear the solidness once you hammer them in. All of a sudden the sound will go from hollow to solid. And you know you're done. If you like what you see here, give me a thumbs up. Would appreciate that. And if you have a question, ask me a question. I'll give you an answer. Um, share my videos. Hit the bell so I can uh, send you a notification when I have a new video. Right now we're in a series of finishing a basement and that series will take it all the way from the beginning to the end. Okay. All right, so you see it there. All of them are on. Yes, they're white. Like I said, take a Sharpie, a black Sharpie, and just color the sides, let it dry, and you're good. If you can get them in black, that's green too. And then you can see here, push it around, and it will not scratch your floor. Those 3M glides are very good. Uh, I have them on my couches upstairs non-issue years and years and years of use and no problems all right guys thanks for watching have a great day